In this video, I will show you how to work in crab stitch. This is used as a decorative edging as seen on the Sweet Marie shawl. Today we are using mixed tape yarn in true blue and an eight millimeter crochet hook. Let's get going. So crab stitch is worked the same as US single crochet or UK double crochet. It's a decorative edging, but instead of traveling around your work from right to left, you're gonna travel around your work from left to right. So it's going to feel a little bit awkward to start with. Um, I'm going to use a different colour yarn just so you can see it really clearly what I'm doing. So what you're going to do, you start on the left hand corner of your piece and you're going to draw the yarn through just like you would for a single crochet edging. And then what you're going to do is you're just going to chain one stitch to start like so. And so normally you travel along this side of the work However, our first stitch is actually going to go through this stitch. So you're going to take your crochet hook under the two first Vs on your edging here. So you're going to go through there and draw your yarn through, just like you would for single crochet. And then do a yarn over, wrapping the yarn under the hook and bringing through both stitches on your hook. So again, we're gonna go into this stitch. So we're working clockwise around the piece. So you're gonna go through this V, bring your yarn through and wrap your yarn again, bringing it through the two stitches on your crochet hook. And you start to get this really nice twisted edge. So again, we're gonna go through the next stitch, wrap the yarn bring it through, wrap the yarn again, and bring it through the two stitches on your hook. And again, we're gonna go through the next stitch, wrapping the yarn, bringing it through, wrapping the yarn again, and bringing it through the two stitches on your hook. So through the next stitch, wrap the yarn, bring it through the two stitches, and it does feel really awkward to start with and it might take a few goes to get it right but once you do start going you really get into the habit of doing it and as you can see it's creating a really nice twisted edge and this can obviously be done in the same color as you're working in or a different color to highlight the stitch i'm just going to work to the end of this side to show you finished effect. And one more stitch. And there you have it. It's a really nice decorative crap stitch edge.